Hi guys, today I'm taking you through the integration of modulus of x and we know that modulus of x is, is in two parts so it can be in two parts so but before that we can represent modulus of x in a graphical manner so this is the graph modulus of x and of and this side is the positive values for x, so it's just an ordinary x. So we are going to say x if x is greater than 0. And this is the negative, this side is the negative values of x. So we are going to say negative x if x is less than 0. But what happens if x is equal to 0? So we are saying modulus of 0 is equal to 0. So this means that we need to put an equal sign on end of the two, just one. So I'll put on this one. Right, I'll prefer this one, but you can choose this one. So once we know this, so we are going to say modulus of x, integral of modulus of x is into two parts. That's x, and this is negative x integral. So you integrate them separately, the x dx so i'm going to get from this i'm going to get a half x squared plus c i'm going to get negative half x squared plus c so we have come to the end of the integration thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe